guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. These Milano Cheek Kiss liquid blushes are absolutely game changing for me. They completely shifted my opinions on liquid blushes and liquid products in general. So before these, I was never a fan of liquid blushes, highlighters, or bronzers because these are normally extremely hard to work with. For example, if I put them on my face, then they could dry down very quickly, which makes it hard for me to blend out. And they are oftentimes very pigmented, more pigmented than I would like on my skin. And I came across these liquid blushes by Milani and I wanted to give them a try. So first I got like the one shade and then later on, because it was so good, I ended up getting three more shades. There are all together six shades in total. I love that these liquid blushes, once applied to your face, gives off a very natural flush from within instead of looking very cakey. In today's video, I want to show you what each of these blushes look like. I'm going to show you the swatches of these products on my arm. Or four out of the uh, six shades. The first shade that I'll be swatching is the 110 Nude Flush. It's my absolute favorite out of the four shades that I got. It provides a subtle yet elegant flush to the cheeks and it's just perfect for the everyday fall look. The next shade is the 130 Cheeky Coral, which like the name suggests is a coral and orange based blush that adds a pop of color to your cheeks. Compared to the more subtle color of the nude flush, this one is slightly brighter and I think it will be more suitable for the summer and spring seasons. The next shade is the 150 Wine Glow. This is a shade that I am all too familiar with because of the Asian glow that I get after I consume alcohol. My face turns a deep shade of red. It is a burgundy color that is very romantic but also works very well for an everyday look. And last but not least, we have the 160 Berry Smooch. Think of a pomegranate and blueberry smoothie mixture, and this is the exact shade you'll get. I think this one is uh, also a very romantic shade, and if you were to go on a date, it would be a really nice addition to your cheeks. Hopefully that will help you decide if you should get it or not. These are extremely sheer but they are very buildable. So because it is the fall season, definitely give the wine glow and the nude flush a chance because these are absolutely gorgeous colors for the fall and winter time. And I've been using this on a daily basis and the wine glow is something that I put on if I just need a little bit extra color on my face. But yes, go for these two colors and you won't regret it. 